everyone, Ricky Bly here, and this is cigarettes. Uh, apparently, it's a. Oh, I don't know if the sound needs to loop again. Anyway, it's a short story game. Okay. Apparently, anyway. Um, I, I don't know much else about it. Sorry, we just need to dive in and do it. I'm a little bit off kilter on my recording tonight because I'm walking down the road to the 24 hour store. Which way are we walking? We walk this way. Oh no! There's an invisible barrier! Well damn, I guess we gotta go down past all these lights. Now, my recording schedule is a bit off kilter. I had to get some repairs done in my basement slash recording studio tonight. Uh, t tonight. The only time they could come to do the work was tonight. So, we caught a bit late than usual and uh, it's weird when my schedule gets knocked off. It throws me whole... It, it throws everything my brain doesn't like a change of routine, let's just put it that way. Well, this is a long road, and there's just, there's no buildings. What kind of weird, what, what kind of weird road is this? Is it the road to nowhere? Well, is that, why is there a shape under this one? Oh, to buy a pack of cigarettes. Oh, I've got to click to advance the story. Way to go me for not noticing that sooner. Yeah. It's 2 a.m. Obviously a night owl. And desperate for cigarettes. That feeling when you smoked your last one and you're just like not tired yet. I used to smoke. I know I shock horror, right? I'm still not exactly I'm not I know the game's called cigarettes, I don't think it's the main point of the story. I wasn't want to get too drawn up on discussing cigarettes, but you know, it kinda of had to come up eventually. It's cold outside. Yeah, it kind of looks it. It does look pretty though. Ah, uh, kind of relaxing. I could just do this for hours and hours and hours on end, but I don't think that'd be very entertaining, would it? But it's fine. I like the cold. Me too. Me too. I find that when you're cold, it's more fun to get in from the cold and warm yourself up than it is to get in during a really hot, sweaty, horrible summer day and then try to cool off. I'd much rather come in and warm up. Have a nice cup of tea, a crumpet, a hot water bottle, dressing gown. I'm almost finished. I'm almost. What do you mean I'm almost finished? How can. What do you mean you're. What? Oh, there's this thing. There's this thing I was working on. And it's almost done. Okay, I'm gonna focus on the story now. I'm sorry, I keep getting drawn off into random little ex sub stories of my own life. Let's just just focus on this story. I've set myself a deadline. Oh, that's always a disaster. Do you like the whooshing noise they make as they go by? That's why I'm here. At 2 a.m. I took this walk as a break because I'm tired already. Now I'm out of cigarettes. I think we'd establish that. I'm almost finished. Finishing is what matters the most. I've had too many abandoned projects. If I was born rich, I'd be asleep right now. Or at the party, I guess. There's a party? There's a party somewhere? What's your project? Is it a party pooping machine? Because you didn't get invited to the party? Not that I like parties though. I can see the store. Just being able to choose whether you work or not. Or whether to work or not. But I'm not rich. So parties won't bother me. Right now I'm walking down this shitty street to the 24 hour store at 2am to grab a packet of cigarettes so I can finish this project and then go to sleep, wake up and go to work. Wow, it's like me minus the cigarettes. But my project it's a joke. There's so many better games out there. I see what's going on here. Who would waste their time on mine? I would. Hi. I would totally waste my time on it. Oh. They always start the same. I need to make a... Oh, okay. Let's have a look at these. I need to make a website. Everyone is going to like this. Ego. Growth. It's great. I'm genius. All those things I've got to do. I'm so happy. <sighs> Uh, I'm the best.
best. I am me, I am me, I, this will change everything. Better take a look at the best. Success! Oh, there's more on the floor. Fortune, success, fame, and greatness. Confidence. Talented. There's goodness, lightness. Oh, this is... You have this idea. Bing! And it's all good. You feel uplifted. Inspired. Contemplating how well you're going to do. Planning ahead. Taking notes. Maybe even starting to make a, a better prototype or something. But then... No... Things go still. What? Oh gosh. Ah, I'm just falling down. What the heck? It's all wrong. It's all. I need to make money if I only have more time. Circumstances. They just. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, hang on. They just won't let me work. I don't feel like it. Idiots! Someone will disturb me. I haven't checked Reddit for a while. I wonder what's on Twitter. Tomorrow or not now. I'll get to it. Oh gosh, yeah. All these feelings. All of these feelings, some of them I can relate to. I have an email, I deserve a break. Some of these I can kind of relate to myself. I'm just gonna let this spin for a while. Um, not with the game making side of things, but actually recording videos myself. It's like finding time to do it. I can only do it on an evening during the week because I have to work too, you know. This doesn't pay the bills. I love doing it, but it doesn't pay the bills. So you can kind of see but working on games is a whole different matter i mean i'm playing something that's probably going to take me 10 minutes 15 minutes to play it. this guy's put a lot of effort into this you know yeah this idea just it doesn't seem as good anymore but just stick with it and nothing happens there's no time or you're just tired for a plethora of reasons you do, well, nothing. But then, whoa, fear sinks in. Oh gosh, I, I can't do it, it doesn't work. Fake, fake, oh gosh, worthless. Whoa, not good enough, it's not good enough. What will they think? Oh, now it's not just tiresome it's painful to do your work it's painful to do what you've told yourself you like to do but that's not the worst part the worst part is uh, another year passed by and you haven't made a single step Maybe not. I've learned some new things. Oh, I see. We're back at the start of the street again. Overall, I'm a better developer than I used to be. But does it matter? Most of the things I've learned, I've learned the hard way. It's not like I was having fun at all. Most of the time, I was either frustrated or scared. Is this the way to do it? This is really interesting. This is a really interesting take on a gameplay mechanic. Being told the story of someone who's making a game. It's literally a game within the game scenario. Is life supposed to consist of fear and frustration? I mean, they're scared that my work won't match my expectations, or frustrated because my work fails to match my expectations. But you have to put in work. There's no way around it. It's supposed to be hard at the beginning. But I don't get better at handling it. If you think about it, I was better off when I was just starting out. Now... I don't even think about the actual work that's being done. Most of the time, I'm worried about my expectations of it. 
It's hard to admit that. Judging from the outside, it looks pretty much the same. But it's different. No wonder I picked up smoking. It makes things much smoother for me. But there's so much to endure. It always seems like the end is in reach. Oh, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> it's that feeling of like, oh, look at this. Clock, clock, clock. <laughs> this is where a clock is meant to be. The kind of feeling. Oh, oh. Oh, I meant to be. You just have to wait a little. Put in a little work. A little patience. Oh, I get it. Maybe learn this or that. Uh, maybe when I have this. Maybe when I have that. Wow, really? Gosh, I mean, sometimes it feels like I'm getting nowhere. Oh gosh, you okay? Uh, still can't get past that door. Sometimes it feels like I'm getting somewhere. <laughs> oh, wow. But then, yes, but then I realized it was not the case. It was just me being stupid. Wow, it's... I still can't get over the fact that it's a game about a game developer who's struggling to make a game. I can't... Quite... Oh, gosh. I... Literally want everything for nothing I want to be rich but I don't want to do the work required or responsibility I want to be a game designer but I don't want to do a lot of bad games I want people to hold a good opinion about me but I don't want them to hold a bad one I want to be a writer but I don't want my writing to be judged or learn proper grammar. <laughs> okay, that's a good little line to chuck in there. We've always seen the bad grammar in these indie games, haven't we? I want to live. I don't want to die. Is it just for me to live forever? From my perspective, yes, but from the outside? I mean, how about everyone else? What if we just stop dying out of old age? At this time, it would probably be fine. But do I consider the past? How about that happening a thousand years before? My wishes are ever changing. Yesterday, I want to be poor, to scorn riches and fate and just be happy as myself. Today, I'm sick of it. I want to be rich. By any means necessary. Tomorrow? Who knows what I'll come up with. That's just generally the human condition. But, I mean, it's so well put into perspective. Like, how can there be any progress? Where there is no destination. But how can there... How? Oh, oh how can there be... Yeah, okay, grammar. He, he called it himself, though. How can there be any true destination? Hmm, I should probably quit smoking. Tried before, never worked. I was able to have weeks, months, but it's just a matter of time before I let my guard down and those sneaky bastard cigarettes just sneak up behind me again and jump me. Was I quitting at all? It looks more like postponing the next cigarette into infinite future. I was getting better at postponing smoking, but never actually quitting smoking. 
Is it about trying to stop putting cigarettes inside my mouth, or is it about trying to stop relying on cigarettes? Is it about trying to stop looking for external affirmation, or is it about trying to stop relying on external uh, affirmation? Hmm. Is it about trying to stop finding faults in others, or is it about trying to stop relying on others so much? <laughs> is, is it about trying to stop feeding my ambition, or is it about trying to stop relying on its source as a measure of my worth? I... I need to think. Maybe I can change after all. Oh, dear player, thank you for finishing my game. I hope you take this with a grain of salt. There is no way to learn this in 10 minutes. And there is no way I'm there myself. My only hope is that I can point someone who's struggling in what I believe is the right direction. But I can hear you cry out already. This, this destination is right only to you. I am different. I am me. It is common to think that truth is relative, but it doesn't seem so to me. How can 2 plus 2 be relative? What is relative? Oh, what is relative is our judgment of things, and our judgment of things is not the truth. And here we part. I wish you no luck on your journey. I wish that you won't need any luck. Farewell. <laughs> Just stick it in there. <laughs> really life affirming stuff, and then if you like the game, like, of course that's that's the whole point of making games, isn't it? It's the affirmation, and it's the okay, okay. If you've stuck with me all the way through this video, I really appreciate it because these really story driven ones with no real action and stuff in them, I know they can be hard going, and I am sorry, but I really wanted to to do to play this game. I wanted to see what the developer had to say, and I had a feeling it was going to be one of those storytelling games but it's it's really interesting and this developer is obviously reaching out to people playing his game for whatever reason they're playing it and as i was playing the game i even pointed out the parallels i was seeing in some of the comments here and my own not really ambitions i mean i like to think of my YouTube channel and YouTube videos is just a just a little fun thing to do on an evening, but it's uh, it's a, it's the work that goes into it is actually a, a, it, it's uh, it's more effort than some people give it credit for. I'm determined and I'm dedicated to doing a video every single day for you, and I really want to stick with that. It's 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 partly. It, I like to say mostly actually because I really enjoy getting to play lots of different games but it's also a big chunk of it is not wanting to let down the people who've started investing their time into watching what I do and that is a big part of it and that part's getting bigger to me now it's it's a case of not wanting to let people down I don't want to do videos just when I feel like it I want to do videos because I have set myself that target to keep other people happy so that, that that was an interesting little delving into someone else's kind of thought process and i really enjoyed it and it's really kind of inspiring and who knows maybe it'll inspire some of you to go out and fulfill what you want to do or at least at least figure out what you want to do or how you're going to do it and that was a very very motivational little piece of art that's what that was and it was it was beautiful i really 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 enjoyed it it was a very well told story so uh, if you felt the same excellent if you didn't i am so sorry <laughs> it's all relative right oh wait no what is what is relativity that was cigarettes and you all have yourselves a fantastic morning afternoon evening or night I'll see you next time around. Bye.